Friendships, love, safety, and happy. My name's Teresa, my son is Sean. He's in the eighth grade. He's been here since kindergarten, so nine years. My name is Chris Spinelli, and my daughter Ava is in her fifth year at St. Patrick's. She came here in nursery school, so she started from the very beginning. My name is Lee, and I have three children at St. Patrick's. Um, my oldest is in third grade, and I have a son in kindergarten, and my youngest is in the nursery program here. The first thing a parent looks for mostly is warmth, nurturing environment, you feel welcomed. I'm not saying I didn't think about the academics, because of course I did, but at five you just want your kids to be comfortable and happy. And I got that whole feeling from St. Patrick's. The first time we came here, I came like any other parent for uh, an open house. I was met very warmly by the uh, principal, by the staff. Having graduated here in uh, 1993, I knew the uh, religious value and the uh, educational value that uh, St. Patrick's would have brought to my daughter's life as it did to mine. St. Patrick's was the first and only school that we looked at. Um, we right away liked that this is a place where children are challenged to grow spiritually and intellectually and that it's also just a warm and caring place. As my child grows, of course now you're thinking academically, I hope they're getting what they need, you listen to other parents talking about what their kids are doing in schools, and we're a step ahead of everybody. St. Patrick's has outscored all the schools in the diocese in most academic subjects. Uh, I think the education that the students receive here at St. Patrick's is second to none. I couldn't think of a better place for my daughter to be laying the groundwork for uh, her future schooling. This is a place that um, encourages children to grow so many aspects of themselves. They learn art, they learn music, they're taking Italian. This is really a place where children can, can grow holistically and in their relationship with God. The teachers here and the staff and the faculty, I've, I've never seen a more committed faculty than, than here. These teachers are, are special because they give so much of themselves to teach our children. They really um, understand what they're teaching and why they're teaching it. My name is Gina Keenan, and I've been a teacher here at St. Patrick's for 22 years. My name is Brendan Maloney. I'm the eighth grade homeroom teacher at St. Pat's. I'm also the middle school ELA teacher. This is my third year. Hi, my name is Karen Lally. I work in the early childhood in St. Patrick's Catholic Academy. I've been working here for the past nine years. I'm Kathleen Curatolo. I'm the principal at St. Patrick Catholic Academy. This is my fourth year here, but I came in with 27 years of experience as a teacher, a principal, a superintendent. I kind of have done everything leading up to this point and coming back to Catholic education. And that was a decision that I made because I love what I do. A lot of things have changed at St. Patrick's since we've been here. The school is renovated, repainted, bright and beautiful. The room I'm in, the library, was our first project. For us, we wanted an environment that made you want to read. The new science lab opened a couple years ago. Um, my background is in engineering, so I was very excited when I heard that they were renovating the STEM lab. Everything that we loved about St. Patrick's when we looked at it has, has grown and expanded in the last few years. I'm a big fan of nursery through eighth grade education in one building. I think the little ones should watch what the older ones are doing and say, I can't wait to do that when I get older. We do a lot of interaction. Eighth grade works with first grade. The kindergarten teaches the sixth grade sign language. So there's lots of cross classroom activities. One of the things we do here at St. Pat's, which is great and innovative, is that we have a, a coaching program. We have coaches come and assist the teachers, help them, give them guidance. And I can say personally that everything that the coaches do for us have really helped the students succeed. I think that's important because I think even as teachers we need to constantly be growing and changing as our world does. We believe in continuous education for our teachers and that's why we have a coach to work with them. One good teacher 
sends out a ripple effect that you can't quantify, you can't put a value on. It affects the lives of those 20 students, but will affect the lives of every person that that student then comes in contact with. Those students can take that impact into their future and into their future classes and into their future worlds. And the growth uh, that comes from this is exponential and really beautiful. In this school, the kids want to do well. And we wanted to cultivate an environment where they soar. So I'm a big believer that we don't just come, do our job, and go home. We need to build relationships, and we need to build relationships with our students. They come to school and they care, and, and they show that they want to be there. So as teachers and as adults in their life, we can't just say, you know, we're here for you from 8 o'clock till 3 o'clock. If they ask us to go see them play volleyball, play soccer, play baseball on the weekends, we're going to be there for them. Because then that shows them that we're there for them, just like every day they come into school and they're there for us. We feel it's important in St. Patrick's to not only know who the child is, but to make them feel known. Because we feel if a child is known, they thrive. Well, I would encourage anyone who is thinking about St. Patrick's to, to come and see us, to meet us, um, to let us talk to you in person. I'd love for you to be part of our community. It's a wonderful place to, um, to watch your children grow and to spend time as a family. I could come up with a million wonderful things about St. Pat's, about the sense of community, about the sense of faith, about the curriculum and the academics their children will get, but honestly, Come see St. Pat's firsthand because um, my words could not do it justice. We want to push them to be the best person they could be, but also the best academic they can be. And we know that we're in the business of preparing them for the future. And nothing beats a good foundation. These kids are my life, they're my heart. The school is my life and my heart. And um, St. Patrick's is home. School is more than just coming to learn. It's, it, it, it's about creating a warm environment, uh, a nurturing environment, and an environment that children uh, want to come to. I mean, I, I enjoy their company, not just teaching them, I enjoy their company. I enjoy spending time with them. I enjoy being around them. They, they make me happy. They actually fill my heart. When I'm with them, they really fill my heart. Friendly, faithful, family, community, home.